Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining me this evening. My name is Brenda Lee Bridges, and today I want to talk to you about confronting self and hate. Take a few minutes and explore what does that mean to you? Confronting self and hate. Confronting self and hate could be very challenging. First and foremost, you have to be able to identify with something in order for you to develop those tools and concepts and be able to answer those questions. Identifying safe self and hate can come from different experiences in life. We all come from different backgrounds, different cultures, ethnicities, and we were raised differently. Our experiences have shaped us who we are today. We will all run into situations where um, our opinions, our views will be distorted and will have different opinions in regards to different issues. Being able to understand and accept those challenges and insecurities and uncomfortable feelings is what becoming self-aware. What is self-awareness? Self-awareness can be described as being able to accept all facets of your life, whether they be good, whether they be bad, whether they be challenging, whether they made and contributed to the person that you are today, that is what self-awareness is. There are a few strategies that can be utilized to be fully competent and be able to describe as to what self-awareness could be. First and foremost, please understand that we all make mistakes. As humans, we will go through life making mistakes. We'll be faced with challenges. We'll be faced with challenges. And the goal is to ensure that um, we are able to acquire those tools in order to positively move forward and create growth. Secondly, don't be too critical on yourselves. It's okay to make mistakes. Tell yourself that it's okay. Explore new challenges, try to better yourself, and equip yourself with information and knowledge that causes growth. Self-awareness is important. Third strategy is accepting yourself. Accepting yourself is very challenging. Um, we constantly are faced with different things in life that sometimes we doubt, our, doubt ourselves. Um, we don't understand why certain things happen, but accepting yourself is very crucial. Um, Self-awareness is a key to growth. Um, I think it's important to go above and beyond as to your own knowledge, as to what you've been taught, and ensure that 